Okay, this video deals with setting up the function key uh, to give you a second unit of measure. Um, this is going to, the toggle function will be on the function key. And once we set it up, you'll be able to press and release the function key to get another unit of measure. Uh, right now we're set up in grams, um, and we want to be able to press the function key and get pounds or any other unit of measure. Um, so we need to set that up. We First thing we do is turn the unit off, and then turn it on, press and release the tear key during the segment check. Now press and release the function key until you see FN dash key. Now press and release the tear key, and right now it's not set up, so we want to set it up. Press and release the function key until you see second unit. Press and release the tear key. Okay, you get a little circle telling you that that is confirmed. Now we need to define what the second unit will be. So um, as you can see, I press the zero key to go back. So let me just show you that again. From second unit, you did press the tear to get the circle. Press the zero key to go back one level. Now press and release the function key until you see setup. Then press and release the tear key. WP1. Press and release the tear key. In turn, press and release the tear key. We're at parameter 1. We need to be at parameter 2 because that's where we can define our second unit of measure. So we did press the function key to get to parameter 2 from parameter 1. Now press and release the tear key. And you'll see second weight unit displayed. Press and release the tear key again. And now you can set the second unit of measure to uh, anything that is in our list. So press and release the function key until you find the second unit of measure that you want. I'm going to set it up for pounds, ounces. Okay, so press and release the tear key, get the little circle. Now press and release the zero key once, then press and hold the tear key until the unit resets. Now, our initial unit of measure is grams, and if we press the function key, we now get pounds and ounces. So um, that's how you do it.